Hey YouTube, this is Aaron 7PM with 7PM Tech. Today I'm going to be giving you a short tutorial on how to move a borderless form in Visual Basic.net. So here I am at the 7PM Tech website, 7pmtech.com. I'm going to go to the code library and I'm going to go to the search, or you could use the search up here, and I'm going to type movable borderless form. Now the method that we're going to use is method number four. Simply copy and paste the code right here. Let's open a Visual Studio. Create a new project. And the project, project that we're going to use is a Windows Forms application. Let's name the project Movable Order Orderless Form. Uh, so here we have our new form, but it, it has a border, so what we're going to have to do is make it borderless. In order to do that, we're going to have to click on the form, go to properties, scroll up until uh, you find form border style. We're going to want to change sizable to none. Now let's just see what happens whenever there's no borders. See, we can't move it at all. This is a problem for many people that want to use custom forms or skins or whatever. Game hacks usually have no border sometimes. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to the code view by pressing F7 or right clicking form and pressing view code. So then all we're going to do is take that code that we got from the 7pm tech code library and paste it straight in to the code. We're not going to put it under any event at all. So let's debug it. And as you can see, it now moves perfectly with your mouse. Now what makes this code different than all the other codes is that all the other, almost every other code uses an event. The codes that I posted in the code library, methods 1, 2, and 3, I'll use the forms mouse down, mouse up, and mouse move event. This method does not use any event at all. Alright, well, thank you for watching. This has been a very simple tutorial on how to make a movable borderless form in visualbasic.net. I'm Aaron 7pm from 7pm Tech, and feel free to watch the rest of our videos on YouTube, subscribe, and go to 7pmtech.com for our forums and our code library with thousands of lines of code. Thank you for watching.